Man, I made a mistake. Um, I run a fuel additive, um, like diesel treat, basically. So I fill it up. I try to do the best I can, like every time I fill my tanks, I, I throw some diesel treat in it. I usually, when I park the truck at home, I usually go ahead and put it in at home while well, I brought it in the car with me in like a sealed like measuring bottle and everything and the car like my car reeks of it but I ended up putting it in the trunk it was so bad but anyways we're here at the the yard gotta knock out this oil change real quick and uh that'll probably be it for today Bring him a stick. Bring him a stick. <laughs> That's what we did. Ended up playing pool with some fucking old man Gary that was a shark. Really? In one bar, yeah. Oh, dude, I was gonna say not even a drip, and then I fucking buffed it. Having the uh, little valve like that see if I get this right or not. I, always, I never get it right. power today.
individuals. change and a couple to add. Okay, cool. Take this. I like to fill <clears throat> the oil filters. Um, some guys don't. Some guys feel like it's already an oil engine. No point of filling it. I like to fill it. <clears throat> Just so there's like no chance of dry, a dry spot. When you're filling it, It'll fill up and it'll look like it's full. Kind of wait a second, it'll all go back down. Quick story. I was talking to uh, one of my buddies, John, and uh, he was telling me that the guy he works for. I don't know what year his truck is, really cool truck. Um, but he had a fuel pump go bad, but they caught it before it ate the motor up. But I think they rolled a new set of bearings or took the set of bearings out, you know, out of the bottom end to look at it. And uh, they said uh, his bearings look brand new. The truck has 800,000 miles on it. They said his bearings look brand new. And uh, not deleted or anything. You know, I feel like a lot of people think you have to delete everything. It's, it's not deleted. And uh, <clears throat> X15 Cummins, I believe. Might be an ISX, but Cummins. And uh, he runs Shaper. Ran it since new, and uh, maybe that's a part of the reason why the bearings look brand new. Maybe it's not, but I feel like having quality oil, if it's an option, why not? You know? so she's about full, so we'll go ahead and uh. Toss her in. Toss the rest in the oil pan on this one.
Stars t-shirt. I just got a bunch of them made. Here's the back. And I also got some hats made. So uh, if you haven't already, go ahead and pick them up. The link will be in the description or the first comment. Um, and let's get on the video. Those of you that have stayed this long into the video, here you go. I was finally able to pick up my Fox body after a little over a year of not seeing it, not able to really know what was going on with it, and so on and so forth. I brought it over to my buddy Elias's house here, and man, he uh, he uh, he's promising me that we're gonna get this car rolling, man. So very soon you guys are going to be seeing a lot more race car content i've been getting some uh comments talking about where are these race cars at well my race car was in chassis jail for over a year and uh not much got done to it but uh we're gonna we're gonna change that real soon appreciate you guys don't forget to go check out the merch um i i thank all you guys that are supporting it um they're flying you know the shirts are flying off the shelf and uh, the hats are doing the same, so appreciate you guys.